Hi and welcome back to Average Previews. This game is called Gold Goliath. It was made by Whalebox Studios and published by Octopus Tree. Now this is an interesting one because this at first I thought that it was just an action RPG but it seems that it is an RPG, yes. But it seems to have survival elements, it's pretty much a survival game of sorts. But it's different than some of the other survival games, let's just say. So let's go in. I've been playing it, uh, I tried both the keyboard and mouse and the Xbox controller, Xbox One controller. And I think I prefer this game with the controller. when you take the default setup, that is. I'm not sure if you can change it. No, you cannot change it, so it doesn't matter. The main problem I have with the, uh, with the keyboard and mouse is the camera control, middle mouse. That is... Well... It isn't the worst, it works. Anyway, let's get into the game. So, you are this character. You crashed in a plane. To here. Now, I think I have the materials needed. 3, 5, 7... I need to chop down one more tree. All the materials I have found so far is the trees uh, for wood and raisin, the bushes for twigs, you can find these mushrooms. Mushrooms look different, some are in the ground like that and some are like this here. Oh, this is in the air. That is new. Anyway, um, there is some, somewhere there is, there are also berries. It took me a while to find them because I didn't notice that the quest has this uh, little arrow. Pointer. When I find more berries then I will let you know. But right now I need to create myself a Goliath. What are the... oh, these are spiders. I'm in a safe zone at the moment. The spiders can't get in here. This uh, I found near my... I will show you the crash site. Now what happened here, I have played this game about 10 minutes, 15 maybe. What happened here is I created this camp. This is my plane. Then I went out to search for someone and uh, this guy attacked me. So I ran back into the plane and I somehow managed to destroy the plane and crush this guy with this wing piece. That was fun. But yeah, I'm pretty much in the beginning. I have done maybe three quests so far. It does have quests. And it seems to also have story. I will take these. These are the repair kits for the Goliath. Good for making leather belt. Right? Healing ointments are berries and coal. Coal you get by burning uh, wood and also twigs, which is new. We don't know other games which give you coal for twigs. 
the only problem is that Ah, what does this do? Nothing The only problem I have right now I have no idea how to make The golem I think I have everything I need Right, I'm back and it seems that it was that easy One moment I need to just use in the base camp uh, this The camp ability And here it is, Goliath Construct Oh, weapon construction, garage and laboratory Are here as well, interesting I always miss the most obvious things, somehow. This is your Goliath construct. Here you can build Goliaths from different parts and rebuild your broken Goliath. Now head... Oh. I need more logs. Currently this game is on my hard drive instead of the SSD So that autosave uh, As you saw it uh, stopped the game for a sec But it isn't too bad I can make the head now I can make everything Woodworker, this is my first Goliath Because why not, right? Special action, press P to quickly roll in the selected direction Lightweight and mobile Goli Goliath from environmentally friendly materials Nature, quickly overheats at high temperatures and can catch fire taking damage Regenerates damage in water or high humidity Specific parts can change this behavior Overdrive Media fills for running, hold the light Attack to activate overdrive Catapult, throw a huge boulder causing damage to anything in that impact radius This ability unlocks at level 4 Level 6 and level 17 Alright Come up you there, it's Dave again I've got big news, listen buddy I don't think we're on the same world What? This world is made of all these bits and pieces and people and creatures that have pulled from all over the universe But they haven't all stuck together like a planet It's like they're chunks all orbiting around something at the center But how can we communicate by radio if we're on different chunks? That's the thing, we, with the way these orbits work, sometimes we sink, swing close to each other and the reception's good and sometimes we're far away. The reception's bad. Sometimes we, we're even completely blocked from each other and we can't communicate at all. Oh, for crying out loud, loud, I spent all this time building a big armored walking robot thing to get to and you're not even on the same world. I was wondering why you weren't answering my calls. Silver lining, mon ami. You know, the portal that's near the black obelisk in the base, you mate, it doesn't work, right? Well, I did some experimenting on mine here. And it just needs a couple things to make it work. A, tree, a green gem, a little clue, and a stick. Even jury rigged together like that, it'll get you from world to world. Then we can start figuring out how to how to meet up. Yeah, I know where those things are, okay, I'll get to work on it right away. I can already... No. I think I have to craft it. How do I... Oh, it wants me to go and...
How to... Okay. You can follow me. It wants me to find more of these gems. Of crystals. Although I have a few, I think. Yeah. 16, although those are gems, it wants crystals. Oh no, it, it is the same thing after all. Repair the portal. Okay. New world added to the map. You are here, nothing interesting. Markwood, Winter Steve, Fever's Cross, The Wild Wo Wood, Doorway, Flawless Land. Interesting. Biome, Land, Faction, The Forest Brotherhood. The loading screens take a while because it's on the hard drive. Yeah, sorry about that. Next time I play it, stranger in a strange land. Chrome, are you there? I've heard some rumors about the world you're on. It sounds like the folks who could help you the most are the Forest Brotherhood. Forest Brotherhood? So a bunch of guys who are related to each other just hanging out in the forest? No, it's worse than that. They're not people and they're not related to each other. They are... Sorry, I didn't get that. Repeat, please, over. I said they are... But they're extremely... When they... Shake the radio set. Silence. Turn off the radio set. And sigh mournfully. I like this, this entire base comes with me. Surely I can leave it. Yeah. Find the forest brotherhood. Let's also get some mushrooms. And let's... Let's put them burning. Here. They are here. Drop the fire. Now let's go out. So I can't... Um, I forgot how to actually leave it. <laughs> Jesus. I'm terrible. What was it? L, B, hold, and then B. Like that. Can I talk to you? No.
I can talk to you, but the quest seems that I need to find them somewhere else. On this chunk, I think. Quiet. Prodigute to tile and well met, stranger. Welcome to the Forest Brotherhood. You appear to be friendly, but my goodness, one just doesn't know. How how might I inquire what your business is in this part of the Mark Markwood? Uh, hi, I'd like to talk with your leader. I've got to figure out how to get out of here. You're a real piece of work. Where the heck is your leader, fancy man? I see. Oh yes, indeed I do. Haha. <laughs> the leader is away at the moment. In fact, he is on a mission. A marvelous mission. A mission to save the foxes. Very livelihood. But who might you be, and why would you like to see him? My name is Kromov. I'm not from here. I need some help to get home. Very good. The Forest Brotherhood is always happy to help those on a mission. Our leader is to the north of here, and if you were to join his group and help them on their secret mission, he would be sure to do whatever he can to assist you. Godspeed and farewell. Okay, thanks a bunch, Foxman. What does the fox say? The fox says a lot of things. What was that? Call the attack button and become faster and stronger. Alright. This guy. Boom. This guy is strong. Too strong. Let's just try to get out of here. That was awesome, one shot in trees. Crystal formation. So they look different here. Oh, and as, the, as it said, uh, we heal in water, and right now it's raining, so we are healing. You there, stay away from this chest, leader soldiers. Oh hi, don't worry, I wasn't going to take anything. Are you one of the expedition members? Fenric the Steady, accounted second class. 
Yes, I've been tasked with making an inventory of all the treasure we found. It's not glorious work, but it's still important. Why, just the other day I... Right, so where did everybody else go? Oh, them? They went to frozen shards. 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 Treasure isn't really the main goal of this expedition, if you catch my drift. And quink secret stuff I can't tell you. It's classified. You don't even ask because I will never ever... Okay, thanks, bye. I'm level 6. Nice. What is this ruin here? Oh, there's a level 15 spider. Oh, this is awesome. Oh, it even looks like I'm wet. Nice. Winter Steve. Forest Brotherhood. This seems to progress really quickly, I hope that there's a reason to go back as well. Victory! Now, what do I... What did I have to do? Exactly, to unlock the other ones. Level 9 is... The body. Fire-based weapons. Five desert golems. I th I'm not in... I'm guessing that this is the tutorial and it just introduces me to different environments. And then the real, be real game begins. Alright, but I think I have played it enough for you to be able to... Um, see whether you would like this game or not. I mean, the art style looks nice. I like the golem art as well. Textures are nice. Graphics are nice, I would say. The idea is interesting that it's an action RPG and uh, you try to survive, but it also has a storyline, a direct storyline it seems, although it is possible that that's just for the tutorial and later on, well, later on you will probably have different types of quests than the storyline. I don't know it though, because this is how far I have gotten, I want to play more of it. Definitely. But this is my thought. These are my thoughts of it. It works fine. It seems to work work uh, smoothly. I haven't noticed any problems. Frame rate is nice and uh, nice and smooth. The loading times are fair. But 
but uh, you can improve those by just putting it on an SSD and then it should go in an instant as with almost everything else so thank you very much for watching this has been Brazinger and you've been watching average previews of Goliath I'll see you next time and also of course let me know if you want to see more of this game on the channel then I will put it in the list